Space World for me. Ah, uh, yes. What you're watching is a ballad, <laughs> a very moving one, dedicated to Kali, our favorite flower. Canadian indie pop band Walk Off the Earth teaming up for Valentine's Day to create a love song to the vegetable. Joining us this morning, Sarah, Johnny, and Joel from Walk Off the Earth. Good morning. Let's go. Listen, we'll get to the niceties in a second because there's so many questions. Cauliflower, why cauliflower? Uh, it's just such a versatile uh, substitute for uh, meat, I guess, you can, you can say. And it's tasty. There's just so many things you can do with it. Uh, when you approach this, Joel, and you're like, yeah, we want you to be a part of this for cauliflower, what goes through your mind right away? I mean, dude, it was just, it was a cool opportunity to, uh, you know, we put up a video of, of us kind of talking about how we want to, it's new year, we want a new, new start, we want to try new things, this sort of stuff. And we got a comment from our buddy Drawer uh, from, the, uh, from Soul Cuisine about embracing the plant-based lifestyle. And I think we'd all, in certain capacities, had a chance to try it, but he actually put us on the hook and said, take on my, my New Year's resolution of, of incorporating a plant-based lifestyle, and I'll take on your resolution. I'll take on some music. Maybe we can find a way to collaborate here. So that was kind of the deal. Um, they got us some of their food. We gave it a shot. It was a lot better than expected, certainly speaking for myself. The cauliflower <laughs> wings instead of the, you know, like, like a chicken wing. Um, we enjoyed it a lot, man. So it was just a fun kind of experience. And uh, we're always looking to do kind of quirky stuff. And this obviously slots right in there. So we had a blast doing it. Yeah, we know you guys are always down to get creative, get quirky for sure. Sarah, <laughs> is cauliflower your favorite vegetable or is it something different? <laughs> uh, yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> just straight yes 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 it is uh look i got to see you guys i will say thank you because you were part of uh new year's eve of course celebrations uh with the city of toronto and we we kind of did that stuff virtually together uh touring is everything's kind of been put on hold but you guys have still been creative romeo eats because cauliflower is not the only thing you've been singing about first of all the dragon fruit song is a bop it is so good <laughs> tell us more about romeo eats and that, that that album the ep that you put out with that yeah, it was just, uh, it's kind of, you know, once the pandemic kind of started happening, we were just looking to do other things that were that we could do in our studio. And our son is obsessed with food. He's He was three at the time, he's four now. He's, he eats everything. And um, we started sharing Instagram stories and all of our fans were like, this is hilarious. We need to learn more about these foods we're eating. So we decided to make this, create this show. And we're walking up here, we make music. So we started writing songs about the the foods that he was obsessed with, and now we have a, a bunch of songs about food. <laughs> <laughs> and the web we series, food, so. a web series, Sarah, the season two just dropped uh, last month. Uh, tell people more about that, what they're going to watch, and kind of why you wanted to do that. Yeah, so it's, we wanted, well, Romeo's passion for food was undeniable, and it was super, gen super genuine. So when we watched, when we started to kind of give him new foods, Johnny's really explorative with foods. He loves to try all kinds of new things. And uh, we kind of just, you know, reflected that on Romeo and he, he took it on right away. So we were like, like Johnny said, we started doing Instagram stories of him eating different foods and live streams of him eating different foods. And people were just like, we love watching this kid eat all this food. You know, how do you get him to eat this? How do you get him to eat that? So we were like, there might be an opportunity here to create something quite educational, not just for kids, but also for parents. And then again, like Johnny said, we can create all the music for it. So it'll just be this like, big full package of a fun show something that we've been wanting to do for a while and uh people just really enjoy watching <laughs> romeo try new foods it is fun so, for everybody guys we down. got we got to wrap it up it's so good to see walk off the earth of course you're gonna be back at the budweiser stage this summer it's gonna be great to see you on stage again and it's great to see you on our screens today